It is done. Let's assume you would like to file for a patent to protect an invention in Europe. Up to now, you could file a central application for a European patent with the European Patent Office (EPO). The European Patent offers the possibility of gaining protection in 44 countries, the 38 contracting states to the EPC, and six other countries. The catch is that after grant, you still have to select each country of interest and validate the patent there. This includes appointing a national representative, filing translations of the patent specification into the official languages in some, and paying annual maintenance fees in all countries. This means considerable extra cost. The current system can also lead to parallel post-grant legal disputes within the individual countries, where the individual national courts and authorities make decisions completely independently of each other. This leads to legal uncertainty for patent holders, as well as additional costs. The ideal solution would therefore be a patent that only has to be applied for once, centrally, and then automatically has uniform validity in as many EU countries as possible, without country-specific extra costs, without additional translations of the patent specification, and with a court that has general jurisdiction and whose decisions are binding for all countries. This will be made possible by the European Patent with Unitary Effect. This is also known as the Unitary Patent. For this, a European patent must first be granted by the European Patent Office. After the grant of the European Patent has been published, the Unitary Patent can then be selected within one month. This is then automatically valid in almost all European Union countries. If necessary, countries from the European Patent Convention which are not covered by the Unitary Patent can still be validated separately, such as the UK, Spain, or Turkey. So when will the new EU patent law come into force? After the delayed start, preparations are now in full swing. In the phase of provisional application currently underway, the necessary structures of the UPC are being created. In February 2023, Germany completed ratification as the last missing step, triggering the start of the UPC. In parallel, due to Brexit, the UPC's pharma section originally intended for London is being reallocated. However, this process will not cause any delays. After ratification by Germany and the expiry of the sunrise period, enabling the users to finalize their preparations, the start date for the UPC is June 1, 2023. For answers to these and many other questions, we recommend you visit the blog on our website regularly. This way, you will always stay up to date and will find out in good time when the new EU patent law enters into force. By the way, you can also find another video on the Unitary Patent Court here. Among other things, it shows you what options you have during the transitional period to opt out of the new system.